Welcome to Hello Experts, where we explore the fascinating destinations and uncover the hidden gems around the world. Today we are taking you to the Malaya, where a major infrastructure project is underway. The East Coast Rail Link project is a 640 km link connecting different parts of East Coast region with the West Coast region. Let's dive in. The ECRL project is a major infrastructure project between China and Malaysia aimed at enhancing connectivity and trade between the East and West Coast regions of Malaysia. The project is being developed by the Malaysia Rail Link and China Communications Construction Company in a 50-50 joint venture with the Ministry of Transport supervising and regulating the project. The ECRL project is a major infrastructure project that will greatly enhance connectivity and trade between the East and West Coast regions of Malaya. The project will provide a fast, efficient and reliable mode of transportation for both passengers and goods. The ECRL project will pass through several cities along the East Coast region of Malaysia including Kuantan, Kaula, Terengu and Kota Bharu. These cities are important economic and cultural centers of the region with rich history and unique attractions. The ECRL project is a massive undertaking with construction beginning in 2017 and scheduled for completion in December 2026. The project is the biggest economic and trade project between China and Malaya, showcasing the potential for international cooperation and collaboration. The project encompasses a comprehensive area of infrastructure elements aimed at establishing a robust rail network within the East Coast region of Peninsular Malaya. Key components include the construction of rail tracks to facilitate seamless connectivity, strategically positioned stations and terminals to serve passengers, and tunnels designed to navigate challenging terrain. The project also involves the creation of various bridges such as the viaducts and overpasses enabling the rail line to traverse rivers and highways. Deports and maintenance facilities are established to ensure efficient upkeep of trains while electrification and signaling systems are implemented to power and manage train movements. Safety. Safety measures such as barriers and warning signs contribute to secure operations. Additionally, the project entails land acquisition and clearing to facilitate construction, the establishment of road crossing for safe vehicular passage and ancillary infrastructure like administrative buildings and control centers. Environmental mitigation measures and community engagement initiatives are integral to responsible execution. The deployment of specialized engineering and technical equipment alongside meticulous logistic and supply chain management ensures the project's successful implementation. Now we will have a look on the benefits of this project. The number one is enhanced connectivity. The second is economic boost. The number third is tourism catalyst. The ECRL project acts as a tourism catalyst, making it easier for travelers to explore diverse destinations. This leads to an upsurge in tourism-related activities, bolstering local economies and creating jobs in the hospitality sector. The project promotes balanced regional development by drawing attention to previously underserved areas. This decentralization of economic activity can mitigate urban congestion and lead to more equitable growth. The ECRL project acts as a tourism catalyst, making it easier for travelers to explore diverse destinations. This leads to an upsurge in tourism-related activities, bolstering local economies and creating jobs in the hospitality sector. The project promotes balanced regional development by drawing attention to previously underserved areas. This decentralization of economic activity can mitigate urban congestion and lead to more equitable growth. Industries can benefit from quicker transit times, streamlined logistics and cost savings. Now we will have a look on the amenities that will be offered by ECRL project. The number one is state-of-the-art stations, comfortable seating, catering services, accessibility, safety measures, scenic views, multilingual announcements, information centers, luggage handling. That's all for today. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.